buyer's month. Buyer's okay. month. We want to give buyers a really good tip this month. Let's do it. And what I see is interest rates have are at an all time high this year. Mm -hmm. And buyers are going, I can't buy as much as I thought I could. Maybe they'll come down. Right. And we so kind of thought waiting. that was going to happen, didn't we? We all thought that was going to happen. Right. We all were waiting for that. <laughs> we're all waiting for it. But now that it seems that we kind of are where we are, what advice would you give buyers? Well, the first thing I would say is don't be scared of the interest rate. All right. You need to talk to your lender. You need to talk to a professional and see what you can afford. Right. Always. That's the baseline. That's Always. the baseline. So don't be afraid of rates. Look at what you can afford. Affordability is the most important piece to me. Yeah. So right now, because rates are high, we're seeing in inventory go up. I think it's 19% over last year. Right? Across the country. Across the country. 19%. Right? 19%. So as that continues to happen, what also starts to happen is because we're not seeing an increase of buyers because rates are so high, prices are starting to soften nationwide. Just a little bit. seeing that. Right? Yeah. And so this could potentially be a great opportunity for a buyer who wants to enter the market with not a lot of competition. Mm -hmm. Because the other side of the fat, the coin is when you are one of those buyers who, and you might be one of them, who is thinking to wait until rates go down mm -hmm. because you want a better affordability. Mm -hmm. The only thing I would caution you on with that is that that could also increase the number of buyers entering the market, which could push us into a situation where you're paying even more for that same house because affordability is a little bit cheaper. So Becky, what do you think if rates are going to go down? You know, if interest rates go down, it's going to get the market excited again. Mm -hmm. It doesn't have to be a big drop, but just an adjustment so people are optimistic again about buying. Right. We're going to have more buyers buying. And if you have more buyers making an offer on a house, we're going to see the value of houses going up. Uh, yeah. What might be an opportunity, Jake, is if a buyer purchases a home now at the prices being where they are, if they buy with the higher interest rate, and let's say a year from now interest rates are lower, their home is going to be even more affordable if they refinance. And consequently more valuable too. Because yes. as rates go down, as buyers enter the market when rates go down, the value of the home is going to go up yes. because inventory is still historically low. Yes. And that's what... Great, great point. Yeah. But that's what we need to look at. Everybody is looking at with this little rates, micro rates, rates. snapshot. Like, it's worse than it was yesterday. And it's like, you know what? We still have good rates. Mm -hmm. We still have good prices. It's still a great time to buy and sell. And over the long picture, the, the uh, value in houses consistently goes up. Right. So get in the market while you can afford it. Right.